On today's video, we're doing something that has never been done before. We already been to the past and created 100 years of burgers. Today, we're going into the future, and that means creating burgers that have never seen before. These are on a whole nother level, and the reasons why they were made this way will just shock you. Enough talking, let's begin. In this future, people work 20 hours a day. They barely have enough time to eat, so food companies found a way to provide a lot of nutrients. But they also figured it out how to keep people awake. And to make this burger, the process is quite complicated. The first thing you need is to cook a burger, just like you normally do, making it as delicious as possible. Once that's done, you have to run it to a very complicated process called freeze-dry. This machine takes out any water left in the burger, and the whole process takes about two days. Once that's done, take a look. It looks pretty pretty similar to a regular burger, but just listen. Now even though this is just powder at this moment, all of the nutrients are still in there. To keep people awake, they also added caffeine, but it needs to be pulverized even more. Once it has become too powder, the food companies added an extra ingredient to it, and I'm talking about this special liquid, which was full of protein. Once done, you gotta mix everything together, and then it just turned into this goo. For quick consumption, they decided to use this, a tube. This might be the easiest process. You just gotta stuff the whole thing, and there you have it. Now, even though this is full of nutrition, it is also like an energy drink, and it will keep your muscles strong. But what does it taste like? Mm, that does not look like a burger to me. That doesn't look like a burger to me, Leo. In today's episode, we eat toothpaste. What is this, man? A new Colgate flavor? <laughs> I, don't, uh, I don't get what this is. Oh, they're hot. What the? That's oh, weird. Man, this is strange. That's so weird. That's so gross. I know he said there's a burger in here, but all I can think of is hot toothpaste. It actually smells good. Hot toothpaste. <laughs> this might sound weird, but I'm kind of excited. So. <laughs> oh, do the honors, my bro. It's all up to you then. All of us together. Enough talking. Cheers. 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 The sound it makes is so gross. Yeah. <laughs> it tastes good. <laughs> it, tastes, it tastes good is the weird part. I don't hate it. It's a little off-putting. Hey. Just uh, squeeze that. I feel like, <laughs> ew, man. Into your mouth. In all honesty, it tastes like a normal burger, but it tastes like someone blended the burger for you, so you don't have to chew it. I hate the texture. It's but look, super gross. It feels like someone chewed up food and spit it in my mouth. That's a, that's gonna be a hard no for me. I kinda like it. In this future, things are super fast-paced. Potato chips and regular snacks are no longer popular, and people were desperate for nutrition. SpaceX was taking people to Mars like it was just a quick vacation, and they created a burger in one bite, packed with a tremendous amount of nutrition. It is everything you need in one tiny bite. And surprisingly, everything started just like as a regular burger, pretty similar to the ones that we cook today. We all know Elon Musk loves to eat, so he made sure that this was tasty. The key was to keep everything as fresh as possible. So SpaceX created this edible wrapper. The macronutrients on this is insane. It has everything the body needs in just one bite. However, it lacked flavor, and that is where the burger comes in, adding every single ingredient to make sure that you taste it. This is a genius idea. You no longer have to waste time eating food. All you need is the one bite burger. It will provide you nutrition for a whole day. Welcome to the burger of the future. This is the burger that conquered space. Damn, look how fancy, oh. What the hell is that? Is that all just a burger in here? Do you eat the wrapping? Probably won't be the first time I eat plastic. <laughs> <laughs> all right, let's do it, guys. Cheers. Cheers. Cheers? That's literally a bite of a burger. That is a burger bite. That's so weird. If it's got all the nutrition in one bite, that's pretty nice. My mind doesn't know how to comprehend this. <laughs> I just ate plastic that tasted good. It's just crazy because it tastes like a single bite of a regular burger. Like yeah. the flavor is perfect. If the point was to make a tiny burger, spot on. It just kind of like dissolves it in your mouth, but as soon as it dissolves, you get that cheese, bread, meat, everything you would taste in a burger. It's really weird. But for whatever future that's from, it's pretty good. Not terrible. Not bad. 
In this next future, the government was in trouble. To combat hunger and malnutrition, they have mandated Nutri-Squares. These are packed with a lot of nutrients and calories needed for each individual. And they came in different variety of flavors. Everything begins with this stickiness, which in this future was extremely popular. To make it, you gotta pack in a lot of calories. So combine a good amount of ketchup followed by honey. Mix everything well and stir. Then lay it down on a silicone mat, spread everything nice and thin, and immediately throw in in the deep hydrator. But you must have at least two flavors. For the next one, combine mustard and honey into a bowl. Once it's mixed, do the same exact process. After 24 hours, you remove it and what you're left with is something quite strange. It is what we like to call ketchup and mustard leather. This is exactly what the government needed. But this does not have enough nutrients. But meat does. However, the humans of this future did not want to have any burgers. So the government chose to disguise it. But still have the element of a normal burger like bread. So we rolled some small balls, put them in the oven to bake, and we got our mini buns ready. To assemble, add the patty to the bun, top it off with some American cheese, and to make it compact like the government, smash it real good. But obviously, at least it had to look appetizing. So cutting out the edges was necessary. And to make sure this thing lasts for a long time, everything was wrapped on the leather that was done previously. First, the ketchup. Then they went in with the mustard. Now this is what the government wants you to eat in the future. And if you resist, there will be consequences. Oh, okay, but... where is that? Whoa. Oh, now this looks weird. I like this. What the hell? It's like a square. This is supposed what to be a cheeseburger? That? I mean, I think there's nothing left to do. I think we just go for it, yeah? Huh, let's go for it. All right. Do the honors, boys. Oh, it's, oh, it's stuck. Oh. oh, it's a sticky burger. Very soft. It's like... It's like... It's, like... it's like a little sticky. <laughs> Strange. All right, I want to try. Please let's stop talking. <laughs> Cheers. Let's go. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. It's sweet. Keep chewing. Keep chewing. It tastes like honey I mustard. Taste everything. Ketchup, mustard. A lot of mustard. The burgers in there. That's so strange. It's like a little bit sweet. It's starting like a candy, but after that, it's a burger. Yeah, I bit into a fruit roll up and I'm chewing a burger. On the inside, very savory, but on the outside, very sweet. It's not bad. But I rather this wrap it with a hot dog. Is this Imagine the that. Oh, this with a hot dog would be no, insane. I'm fat mine. <laughs> <laughs> For the viewers back home, he said he's fat minded. <laughs> what? I think this is successful, it's futuristic, and it's super weird. In this future, everyone was a gamer. It was so popular that most people did not even eat food. So video games company decided to do the unthinkable and created something that is so good that it should be banned and never be created. To make this burger is just unthinkable because everything starts off with a nice delicious burger. Then they grab this beautiful burger and boil it. Once it was boiled for two hours, they strain the whole thing and are left with this. They call it burger juice, but they're not done yet because back into the pan it goes as they need to remove as much solid as possible. For that, they use some egg whites. This will extract most of the solids. Once this process is done, you gotta filter it even more, extracting any possible solids that it might have as now you're left with liquid burger. But this is way too concentrated. So they had to go ahead and dilute it a little bit more with some special liquid. Because in the end, you are left with this, the burger mist, connected to every headset gamer in the world. This is the future of gaming. You don't only play, but you can also taste it. Let's see. What the heck is that? I thought I was here to eat a burger. I know. <laughs> it's like a big peel. <laughs> but do you know how that works? Do you have to press something or what? I think there's a button right here. Oh! Woo! Who's spraying? Hey, it's a party! Okay, who's going first? Ah, uh, okay, okay. You wanna go first? <laughs> it smells uh, more than it tastes. <coughs> yeah. <laughs> Damn, that's a burger, bro. I'm gonna. <laughs> Uh, oh, you, now, now you smell good. Now you yeah. smell good. Yo, this smells like exactly like a burger. <laughs> it smells straight like a burger. See, that's what I tried doing the first time. Oh, this is like a burger bay, bro. <laughs> <laughs> like it's cool, but I'm not getting like filled. I'm getting more hungry, if anything. I'm not gonna lie. Is my girlfriend like the burger? I'm gonna wear this. <laughs> I'm ready, bro. <laughs> 
in this future mcdonald's was dying they had to come up with something that would get people addicted to it so this was created and it took the whole world by storm and since it's fast food it's quite simple to make first you season your ground beef then you open up the ground beef add a piece of cheddar followed by pickle close everything up make a ball and instead of using buns they went ahead and breaded the whole thing as then all there was left to do was to deep fry it once everything was fully cooked the mac burger bites was created now with this mcdonald's were back forget about the old plain meatballs that you have nowadays the mac bites have arrived all right I want a burger. I want a burger. Please. What? Nah. <laughs> what is this? Is that, dude? All right, guys. I guess grab a burger. Burger bite, I guess. Sir, a burger for you? That's not a burger. One thing left to do, guys. Let's try it. Cheers. Cheers. <gasps> oh my God. Mmm. Africa good. So convenient. Bro, have the cheese inside. Look at that. Every element in a burger is here. It's so tiny, it's so compact, but I can taste the bread, the cheese, the meat. Yeah, you get a little bit of everything all in one bite. That is delicious. Even the pickles, bro. I don't know how, how these people do that, but the pickles taste so fresh. It's, this tastes like burger. Yeah, I saw balls in a pouch. I was a little worried. <laughs> you know what? It's actually pretty good. <laughs> In this future, water was a huge commodity, more important than anything else. For comparison, one cup of water will cost you a thousand dollars. So hydration had become a real problem. That's when this burger was created, as it was important to keep the nutrition high, but also give people hydration. Because this starts off as a regular burger. Then, using $5,000 worth of water, you gotta throw in some special chemicals. The idea here is to make it last. We cannot have any type of evaporation, especially because global warming was an issue in this future. And in order to prevent evaporation of the water, this was the only method to do it. The process is just fascinating. Take a look at it. This is just plain old water, but you can eat it. And whenever you throw it in a burger, people were going nuts for it. And surprisingly, since there was no evaporation, it was a lot cheaper to get water this way than to drink the old stuff. Welcome to the future. Let's see what we got. Woo, burger! What the hell am I looking at? Looks like a jellyfish, Mr. Howard. Look at that. <laughs> oh! I am not excited about this burger. I don't know. I, I, the best way to figure it out is just giving it a try, huh? Yeah, I guess we got it. Mm. I think so. Cheers, boys. Cheers. Cheers. Oh, it doesn't taste like much. It's okay for me. I think I don't need the, the glass of water with that. So <laughs> that's enough. <laughs> I can see how this can hydrate someone, quote unquote. I mean, it's kind of nice. Aside from the texture, which is like a little slimy and yeah, really, it feels like almost like a worm. I will say because they do taste like water, it's kind of like refreshing with the burger. Yeah. It's weird, but it's not bad. These are the burgers of the futures, everybody. Let me know in the comments down below which one was your favorite and which one would you like to try? Because I can tell you one thing, they were insane. And most importantly, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, hit that thumbs up. If you're not a subscriber, be sure to subscribe. Let us know in the comments down below if you want to see the steak of the futures. We might just do it. See you guys on the next one. Take care, everybody. Bye-bye.